I think it's cool that you know MTV are taking this up because normally this is something that I only yet get to talk to people about, like who are considered left wing, extreme left wing, or whatever, you know. But um, it's good that it's hitting the mainstream. They have produced a video with two parallel stories running: one of a, a little boy in the, uh, the west, uh, one in the a sweatshop in the east. The boy in the, uh, the west ends up buying the shoes from the sweatshop. The boy in the east. It's actually quite powerful. It's something I've obviously read about a lot over the years, um, and I like the way the director was just making it very flat and not, uh, mm, it's not a, it's just a sort of documentary. It's these things are just happening. Then it's not trying to jump out at you. It's not overstating it. It's interesting, it's sort of, the sort of images I have in my head anyway and sometimes sometimes when you're walking down the high street and you're looking at the incredibly cheap trainers and so on you think mm, that's well, how do they manage to make that so cheaply it just reminds me of uh, one of my preoccupations so it's i'm touched that um that the music goes with that i think it's great the suggestion was made to use all i need probably because of something in the lyrics although i'd never really thought about it before like that the lyrics themselves have a twist to them, uh, which, as I watched it, yeah, the, something in the second verse about um, I only stick with you because there are no others. Uh, when you see the little boy painting the, the glue on the trainers, uh, the base of the trainers or whatever, then that's, yeah, that's, it works quite well. Quite proud of that, actually. Not nothing to do with me, but I'm quite proud of it. Um, Hopefully some level of the emotion in the song will, will jump out of people in the context of those images. Who knows? I'm glad you guys just want to use it, really. You can say that, that uh, the human trafficking and the exploitation is happening over there in the distance, uh, but in the first context of sweatshops, uh, cheap clothes and trainers, uh, electrical goods and so on, that is tainted with pure human exploitation. The West turns a, a blind eye to the fact that it's moved most of its manufacturing elsewhere uh, because uh, labour is cheap and to some extent that's just simple economics and to some extent that's because uh, exploitation could be done behind uh, doors rather than coming to the website to read uh, not very interesting information about what we're up to. We'd much rather people jumped on the links that we put on the side which um, are a lot of a slightly political bent. If MTV exit um does one good thing, it would be to remove the taboo of, of um, this concept of slavery, which is what it is. If they can make it something that is okay to, for, for us to talk about and the people in, um, affected to start to go and find information about it and for politicians to accept the fact that actually this is an issue, then, then uh, you're doing very well, I think. Join the fight to end exploitation and trafficking, uh, go to mtvexit.org.